Tea, we're almost there. <laughs> okay. Should we get the mill with? Any pictures already? Ah, I need to load more film. all this way. My name is Charlotte, and I'm a reporter from Fontaine. You can find me writing for the Steambird. I invited you here not just to purchase your fine tea, but also with the hope that you might be willing to sit down for a short interview. What do you say? An interview? To advertise my teas? I suppose you could think of it that way. We Fontanians are big tea drinkers, too. The Fontaine Market. Then, I'll need some time to adequately prepare. Perhaps we could sit down and discuss the questions you intend to ask in advance. Of course, of course! Please follow me! Is this person also involved in your plan? And here, I thought I had lots of connections. 
I suppose I've been humbled. You sure know all kinds of cool and important people. Over here! Yoo-hoo! Over here! Uh-huh. What? Auntie Shenyun? She probably wants to talk about the next phase of the plan. Let's go while your dad is still distracted. I take it that all is going well? Don't worry, Shenyun. Everything is going according to plan. I knew it. I knew that was all an act earlier. Auntie Shenyun is really something. She was so determined to help me, she didn't even care about making herself and Shanka appear foolish in front of my family. She truly knows how to look out for others. I still have a lot to learn. As for the next step... Oh no! What's wrong, Gaming? Don't tell me you're the ones footing the bill for all that tea. I can't let you do that. Fret not. Reimbursements will be made. Exactly! Think of it more as an investment, as Ningguang would say. We pulled together the Mora so that Charlotte could place the order. She's gonna bring it back to the Steambird as a gift, as well as a sample of the regional specialty. Fontanians will probably fall in love with your dad's tea as soon as they lay their eyes on Charlotte's article. And once all the money from the new orders begin to roll in, getting our Mora back will be a piece of cake! Oh, okay. Business-related matters always seem to go over my head, but I refuse to let you all lose Mora on my behalf. I'll pay you back right now. We can talk about such matters at a later date. There are more important matters for you to consider at the moment, are there not? Yes. I've been thinking about it the whole way here. I have an idea. But I'd hate to cause even more trouble for all of you. Hmm. That is for us to decide. Yeah! We're all friends here! Plus, we wouldn't be here if we didn't want to help, right? Just tell us about this idea of yours. Okay. Whew. So, it's like this. Got it! Just leave it to us! Let's split up and make it happen! We need to do those things we talked about, but we also still have the kite flying competition! Since Xiao already tested out those kites for us, why don't we also go buy one of those mechanical thingamabobs or whatever they're called? We can attach it to our kite! Yeah! Skyward! Welcome back! I see you returned from your trip. I really do have to thank you for all your help from before. Thanks to you, my daughter was able to build a kite with her grandmother that very same day. She even wrote a long letter telling me how much she loved it. Oh, you should really be thanking Gaming, not us! Uh, I'll be sure to. And are you here to buy a kite? Please, take your pick. Device thingies from Fontaine. Do you sell them separately? Ah, yes. Here you go. Please, take it, free of charge. The directions are in the box. It's not hard to install at all. Um, it doesn't feel right for us to just take it. Well, nor would it feel right for me to take your Mora. <laughs> Good luck in the kite flying competition. I'll be rooting for you. All right, then. Thank you. It's done. Let's get down to business. Looks like we finished everything we needed to do. Let's find a good place and put this thing into the sky.
Come here. Allow me. Should we get the mill with? already? Ah, I need to load more film. Okay? Thank you, little girl. Do you want us to walk you back? No need, no need. Master is waiting for me right over there. I suppose I'll go first this time. Okay. Your performance. I've seen many wu-show dances in my time, but I've gotta admit, 
What you pulled off there was breathtaking. Wow. I... I never thought I'd live to hear you say that. You're serious about doing this professionally? A absolutely. I, I know it'll be difficult, but... Then it doesn't matter. What I mean to say is, of course it'll be difficult. But if that's your decision, if that's your dream, then it doesn't matter how difficult it is. As long as you put in the work, then any obstacle can be overcome in time. Really, when I was young, I also... <laughs> Actually, how about we save that story of my past for another time? All I really want to say is, I've changed my mind. And much like this kite, you also deserve to soar to new heights. Dad... Son. Son? I haven't heard that in a while. I bet you're wondering what's gotten into me saying all this. Well, um... <laughs> a little bit, yeah. Anyway, I know I've never found the chance to say this before, but... <clears throat> to me, Gaming... You've always been a great kid. <laughs> All right, that's everything I've got. Did you have something you wanted to say, or...? <laughs> Seeing the two of them talk things through like this really gives Paimon a sense of accomplishment. Now go. Over there, your friends are still waiting for you. Huh? But... you came all this way. I'll be staying in Liyue Harbor for a bit longer. When you have time, we can grab dim sum together. Your treat, right? Dad... honestly... <laughs> <laughs> go. Okay, then I'm off. See you soon. That's quite the smile you've got there, Gaming. <laughs> <laughs> uh, really? <laughs> it's nothing to be embarrassed about. Hmm. I'd like to find and thank Auntie Shenyun, as well as everyone else who's helped me out. If everyone has time, maybe we could all get together and go fly a kite. <laughs> 